Yeah, I feel uh, full confidence. I am happy here with the group. I feel like uh, like a uh, family group. They are uh, next uh, next to me, next next the new player, and they give us to to make uh, good in the training and also for the game. Uh, we have like for like one team. Like we have, of course, we have one goal to to make it end of the season. And it's not only me, you know. It's it's for the group. We have to to do together. It's not only me, but I come here to to give my best also for the team to help them. Uh, yes, because when I was uh, in Jordan, it was my dream to play in uh, top five league. And I do step by step. I go from Jordan to Cyprus, Cyprus to Belgium, and Belgium to France. It's like uh, like I do step by step to come here. Like it's for me, it's not a uh, surprise because I do good two years in uh, Belgium, and uh, I'm sure to to go to like from five top league, and uh, like uh, this club when they give me the over, I can't say no because it's big club here, it's like a good club, big club, and uh, nice city, and also they have good uh, fans, and I can't say no when they give me the over, I say yes. And I am happy to be also here. Ah, yeah, yeah. Like uh, to score more, to give assist more, to do action uh, more, like one against one, and when we are high in high position, to make, uh, to score more and to give assist more. Like because I am winger, I have to do this, but I have to do more. It's yeah, a little bit different. It's high intensity here, but it's the same. Like uh, from the physical, is the same. There, there are. Like there also there is hard physical, and also here is also physical, but is a high intensity. Like Altamari. my name is Musa Muhammad Musa Sulaiman Abu Hamid Altamari. <laughs> last, <laughs> last, <laughs> last, last Altamari. Ako Jerome Adams. Ako. Uh, I've played 17 games already from April until now. I think I'm physically okay. I uh, had the preseason already with my former club and I feel good in my body, sharp and uh, yeah, I'm okay. Uh, I think they've been following from uh, early June but I didn't get in touch with them. They spoke with my agent and not with my club. So I first got in touch with uh, Bruno in uh, July, I think some weeks back, maybe three, four weeks. Yeah. That was the first time I personally got in touch with the club and I spoke with the coach and yeah. Yeah, I think I had a, a lot to choose from, but from Bruno coming down to Oslo, speaking to me and the idea of the club, what they want and how they, they were, they had a lot of details about me. And I think that was uh, good for me to come to a place where I don't need to start afresh to show what I can do or what I can play. They already have an idea of what I can do. And uh, I just, I felt good making the decision for Montpellier uh, above every other club that wanted me. Uh, I think for us as Nigerians, he's a legend. He's played in the national team. I watched him on TV. My mom likes him a lot. So I think I look up to him as a, a legend and uh He's done so much for the national team and I know he's done a lot for Montpellier also. He scored the goal that won the league, right? Sorry? He scored the goal that won the league in 2011. The, the goal. Oh, the goal. Yeah. So I spoke to him also before I came, like two weeks before I came. And he told me about the club and what the club is about. That's a family club, like uh, Musa said. And they treat the players well and all of that. So that also gave me an extra boost to come here. Uh, first, the team comes first. I think uh, as a striker, it's easy to say goals. But if the team is doing well, you will do well. So my focus is we doing well in the games, winning as much games as possible. And personally for me to score goals and help the team to win games. Because if I score three and we lose, it doesn't count for me. So the team is doing well and I'm scoring goals. That for me would be a good season. I just imagine, I've seen many games, I just imagine that it would be physical because we have a lot of uh, Africans in the league. It would be very physical and technical also. I know the French people are really technical in how they play. 
and that was what I imagined. I've seen the games, I see how they play, and I just have to adapt and learn as quick as possible. Uh, I think uh, my mindset about football is they come every week and they give you everything, so you have to just give them in return. We will not win every game, but once they have a feeling that you're connected with them, and then they give you everything. So leaving Norway after just one and a half year with the team, of course, it touched me and the fans and all of that, but I know that I've asked about the fans in Montpellier and how they are and everything. For me, that's a big part of football, and I think I would also enjoy my time here also. Yeah. No, I'm not filling his shoes. I'm just doing me. I'm sure the coaches are aware of that before they brought me. Uh, before I went to my former club, the striker scored 26 goals. That's not my problem. I'm, he's a good player very good player. I've watched a lot of his videos and how he plays, but I'll just give my own part to the team, create my own shoes and uh, just give my best to Montpellier. Okay. Tout d'abord, la préparation s'est très bien déroulée. On a eu plusieurs matchs amicaux où je me suis vraiment bien senti, aussi avec le coach, avec le groupe qui nous ont vraiment très très bien accueillis. Pour moi aussi, vu que je parle français, c'est aussi un avantage. Et puis, euh, donc, euh, non, c'est vraiment... Euh, Je pense qu'il n'y a pas de hiérarchie. Je pense que le coach fait ses choix à la fin. Si, euh, si on s'entraîne bien, on joue bien, le coach à la fin a ses choix à faire. Donc euh, c'est le coach qui décide. Alors mon poste de prédilection, c'est défenseur central. Mais j'ai déjà joué euh, en 6 ou euh, aussi latéral droit. Surtout en sélection, j'ai joué latéral droit. Donc euh, ouais, je peux, je peux m'adapter euh, à l'attente du, du, du coach. Mais mon poste de prédilection, c'est défenseur central. Ouais, je pense euh, vu que j'ai mon pied droit, euh, j'ai mon pied droit, donc c'est plus facile que du côté gauche. Mais euh, comme j'ai dit, euh, je préfère dans l'axe. On a fait, euh, on a fait une bonne, euh, des bons euh, trois premiers matchs. On s'est qualifié euh, contre l'Espagne. Après, je pense que qu'on est tombé sur un gros morceau euh, en quart de finale. Mais je pense que c'était faisable peut-être euh, de, de, de passer contre l'Espagne, mais c'est À la fin, on a perdu en prolongation, c'est le foot et c'est dommage. Non, non, si, si, j'ai pu parler avec eux, surtout quand on a joué contre eux. Alors, un peu, ils ont un peu chambré sur le 4-1, mais, mais ça va. Donc, vu qu'on est passé, c'était mieux. La défaite, elle était, elle était mieux à prendre. Oui, yes. il est une bonne personne. Il est une très bonne personne et il est un très bon joueur. Et c'est nice d'avoir un like, bon contact avec lui pour... To give uh, like good assess maybe for me or to run for him to have good uh, connection me and him maybe to give for striker for anyone but for me he's uh, the best here. Um, I have I have discussions with my previous club because it, it wasn't easy you know to finish because uh, uh, I was there seven years and uh, it wasn't easy to to make a deal you know so. But, but uh, finished well for me. You know, I wanted to come here, so I'm happy here and uh, I'm proud that I'm here. Uh, I know that I'm young goalkeeper, so uh, I come here to to progress, uh, to be uh, to progress well, and uh, you know, be there with uh, Benjamin and Dimitri. You know, to grow up, uh, grow up uh, with them. Uh, of course, yeah, because uh, I'm here today is. Uh, one month for one month so yeah I, I learned so you have a season all uh, in front of us sorry in front of us